Hi, in this video I will talk about the righteous and uh, and when they die and that's interpretation of uh, that I will try to interpret the verse 169 and um, Amramite's surah Do not think that those who are killed in the cause of God are dead they are alive at their Lord enjoying his provisions so it, it shows that and there are exceptions so they will not wait for uh, they will not wait for resurrection so they, they there is a different type of heaven and they will directly go there I think the reason is that so you know interestingly so to understand the reason we have to think using the Quran yeah, you know considering the Quran deeply so for example when you kill yourself you directly go to hell why because it's like game over and you, you decided to stop the game and you have instincts and you are going against the instincts god gave you some precious thing and you are desecrating it there you are being disrespectful uh, and uh, and it's ego is also a selfish thing to do so here and uh, it's like a dying in in the cause of god is like is like you already got the game you fully believe in God and you are you are doing everything for God but I'm not saying that you, you it doesn't mean that you can hurt other people with the name of God it's for defensive so for example defensive purposes and also they reinterpret this and they say like some some people like police officers killed in the cause of God or something like that if they're Muslim they're going to be but I, I, I think that we have to be critical about it because those officers are, are getting paid I think that's my my thing the soldiers maybe but it's a security force is, is different and then like computer engineers working in the security then if they die because of other reasons we cannot say that it's the same so here what we got it is so there there is a person uh, so you are willing to just to sacrifice your life for God simply that's it so that's the price of the God so this is very it is actually very meaningful because if you can reach that degree and there are, it seems there are a few people then God will give you this but this verse doesn't mean that you can attack people and kill naive people um, and so then you are a murderer so there so you have to understand this it very well so for example let's assume you are you are spreading religion and so you and you so you are doing it for willingly and the people some people just say that don't do it we will kill you and uh, so you just keep doing it in a different way you are trying to defend defend yourself but doing it differently maybe so one day then uh, so it so if they kill you for this it you can enjoy this this situation I guess that's the my interpretation they're rejo rejoicing in God's grace and they have good news for their comrades who didn't die with them that they have nothing to fear so nor will they grieve it's it shows that you should be brave you should you should be brave about defending God and you I, it doesn't mean that you should always um, I mean, so you you should sometimes be cautious, but you shouldn't feel fear in your heart if you're doing something good for God. They have good news of, and we shouldn't also uh, make this verse um, as a slogan for for nationalist ideals like you know you cannot just so you 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 it has to be defensive and there are conditions then you will be this so if, if you are going to invade a country for no reason and for but so just only for money then you are a murderer and it doesn't matter which nation you are from and uh, so nationalistic ideas uh, shouldn't be like um, it shouldn't be as important as religious and moral values and they have good news of God's blessing and great grace and that God never fails to reward the believers so that's why the reward is extraordinary 
because it's like you you understand you realize that you are in the in this test life and then you wake up and you're doing everything for God and if you're even the gear your life and then you are the best believer and there, you you just directly go to heaven so it's like you pass the test directly so anyway thanks for watching this video and hope to see you in the next video and this is my interpretation and it can be interpreted differently and God knows better